Kevin Durant early this season said he wanted to be traded to the Phoenix Suns, and now he got his wish. Brooklyn Nets traded um, Durant to the Suns, and TJ Warren is also going to the Suns. And in return, the Brooklyn Nets will get Jay Crowder, Mikhail Bridges, Cam Johnson, and four unprotected first round draft picks in 2023, 2025, 2027, and 2029. Kevin Durant um, is in the first year of his four year, $194 million extension contract. Um, I want to see Chris Paul win a ring before he hangs up before he hangs it up so now the pressure is on for the phoenix suns to win it all and the fact that you kept deandre ayton if you're if you're if the city of phoenix um must be super happy right now because now you have deandre in um devin booker chris paul and kevin Durant. yes their lineup is deadly However, there are two things that concerns me about the Suns team. Number one, their durability. And number two, role players. To win a championship, not only you need superstars, but you need defense. You need, um, what you call it? You need defense and you need role players. Sharing the ball, I know it's not gonna be a problem, but you need to play defense and more importantly, you're gonna need role players. Role players is what give a team their texture, their structure, and their ability to win. We've seen this time and time again. You can't just rely on superstars. So I'm wondering who's going to be the one. I mean, TJ Warren, I mean, he's dealt with injury. So like I said, guys like Chris Paul, Kevin Durant, TJ Warren, these guys, you know, um, have been hurt. I know that Devin Booker it has been sidelined as well, but he's not an injury prone compared to those guys. So durability will play a huge factor in this and um, the role players will have to step up. So I need to look into deep, deep detail on which role players can rise to the occasion, but Phoenix will need that in order to win it all. I know what these um, superstars can do, but it's the role players. The role players are the ones that are going to give this team the strength to win it all. Phoenix Suns should have won it all um, when they were up 2-0 against the Milwaukee Bucks. So now is their chance with Kevin Durant on this team. Now is their chance to do something special. So... Yes, this is great for Phoenix, but I'm not entirely sold yet. As for Brooklyn, they need to learn, and hopefully this is a learning lesson for them, that don't trade away your future, your young pieces, for guys that complain too much, that you can't rely too much, and don't give in. You can't give a player everything. So me personally, i rather build my young core, then trade away my young core for established stars. So it, it's, it was a failed experiment in Brooklyn. James Harden, Kyrie Irving, Kevin Durant, all three of them forced their way out. It was a failed experiment. Now Brooklyn needs to take advantage of this young core and all the draft picks and try to build something um, great from there. I feel bad that for guys like um, Mikhail Bridges and Cam Johnson, who I feel that they were, and Jay Crowder, who I feel that they were the perfect role players for the Phoenix Suns. But hopefully um, they could thrive with this Nets team as they're trying to, um, I don't know, we'll see, we'll see. So hopefully, let, let's see what guys like Bridges and Johnson can do with this Nets team because they're young so hopefully they will have more opportunities um, um in terms of getting their shots um cam johns cam um thomas he's had big games for the nets so um the nets have played well without um kevin durant and kyrie so i'm looking forward to what they will bring to the table